Let's jump into the tutorial without wasting any time. First, I took this background and applied a Gaussian blur to it. I then added a brightness layer and reduced it to darken the background. After that, I positioned our character on the right. Using a black brush, I created a black circle behind our subject. I removed the background of the guns and placed them where they fit best. Next, I selected all three layers, duplicated them, merged them by pressing Ctrl plus E, applied a Gaussian blur, and adjusted the blending options. Then, I added this magical circle effect, similar to Doctor Strange. I created some new layers and used a brush to add shadows around the subject. After that, I added this overlay and changed the blending mode to screen. Now, you may notice some particles on the face, which don't look good. To remove them, simply add a layer mask to the overlay, select the brush tool, set the color to black, and use it to erase any unwanted parts. Next, I added this particle aura effect. I used a special effect brush and applied it in a few places. Then, I converted the layer to a smart object, applied a motion blur, and set the specific settings for it. I added a solid red color layer and clipped it to the subject. Press Ctrl plus I to invert it. Then, using the brush tool with the white color selected, I painted on the subject and changed the blending mode to overlay. I also masked out the t-shirt to paint it separately, ensuring the colors are more accurate on the subject's face. I even colored the eyes separately to emphasize the reaction. Now, watch as I make final color adjustments. For the final step, press Alt plus Control plus Shift plus E to merge all the layers into a new one. Then, apply the Camera Raw filter. You can see the difference after adding the Camera Raw filter. I've provided the PSD file, which you can find in the description. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. A lot of people don't subscribe, so make sure to hit that subscribe button.